Hello once again friends, uh, Coach Scott and once again my friend Adam. Round four, what we're doing today is we're making a nice strawberry ice cream. Remember earlier, uh, we told you you can make sherbets, sorbets, and ice creams. Now the way you do that is using pre-frozen material. So let's get started. So we are using soy milk. We're going to put one cup of soy milk into our machines. We're going to put about two, two and a half ounces of turbinado cane sugar. Now, yes, of course, it is sugar. So if you have diabetes, pre-diabetes, or other blood sugar management problems, then using like stevia, honey, and agave nectar uh, will do you much better. Now, I don't better give me that uh, bottle. Vanilla extracts 35% alcohol. He's trying to stay off the wagon, so. Flabbergasted. Here goes strawberries in now. Ready for the strawberries. Pull back. Pull back. Pull back. Nice chunks of strawberry. That's the way I like my ice cream. Sometimes so, the whole strawberries. He has a chunky strawberry ice cream. That way I know That's it's amazing. artificially flavored. I have proof that this is real strawberry ice cream, not that fake stuff. Are you hungry? Yes. Do you have a fork? solidity in there to solidify the flavors and all of the, the resonance frequencies that's going on in the ice creams, you have to have a fork to eat it. If you're not eating your ice cream with a fork, then you know, it's not, it's just cream. And this is, this is serious. I mean, look at that. That's a, one fork will can fill you up with the with real ice cream. You use a, you know, manly pandy kind of ice cream, you're going to be eating all day. I need just one forkful. That's convenience. Saves you time. Just take one forkful. So, as you can tell, Adam comes from a little different place, I think, than we do. Uh, are you even from Earth? <laughs> this is crap. <laughs> <laughs> At any point, I believe round four goes to the Vitamix. We do have, a, in fact, definitely have a nice, smooth ice cream. So, bon appetit and thank you. 